Welcome to the LIGO Exploration Center. This center was funded by Washington State and the Office of Superintendent of Public Instruction. One of the first things you'll notice when you come into the center is the Nobel Prize in Physics. This is a replica medal donated to the center by Rainier Weiss. In 2017, Rainier Weiss, Kip Thorne, and Barry Barish were awarded the Nobel Prize in Physics for the first detection of gravitational waves. Another unique feature as you move further into the lobby is this gorgeous bench that mimics waves. And as you move a little farther in, you'll see this window that opens out and sees a beautiful view of Rattlesnake Mountain and the shrub step that surrounds LIGO Hanford. Throughout the center, you will see hardware exhibits that highlight the technology we use throughout LIGO. Here you see a silica glass fiber. We use four of these fibers to suspend our main mirrors, which are 40 kilograms each. One of the hardware exhibits you'll see is a prototype of our quad suspension system. These suspension systems are used to suspend our main mirrors and keep our mirrors a million times stiller than the ground underneath your feet. One of the areas in our new center is a classroom space. This space will be used in lots of different environments from field trips for students to explore hands-on activities, including engineering design and the science that we do at LIGO, as well as for teacher professional development. Designers work to make this a creative, inspiring space for students to do activities. On the floor are wave patterns, colorful cabinets, and on the ceiling you see tiles that mimic warped space-time. Our photo wall highlights the amazing staff that works here at the LIGO Hanford Observatory. From business office and educators to computing, scientists and engineers, everybody has an important part to play in making LIGO successful at detecting gravitational waves. As you look up in the lobby, you'll notice this beautiful chandelier that alludes to stars in the night sky. At the heart of the Exploration Center is the Discovery Hall. This is a hall full of hands-on exhibits so students can enjoy and learn about LIGO science, fundamental physics like waves and pendulums, and exciting work like gravitational waves and general relativity. Optics are central to the technology of LIGO, from our main mirrors, which are some of the purest you'll find in the world, to several different kinds of lenses and optics that are used to make our laser beam behave the way we want it to. This table lets students play and learn about the different types of lenses and mirrors and how they affect light. From the gravitational waves we detect to the light waves we use to make those detections, waves are a central part of the science we work on. This giant slinky allows students to explore what affects waves, how to make larger amplitudes, different frequencies, and the reflections that can occur. To achieve the sensitivity that we need, LIGO's mirrors are suspended as pendulums. This pendulum table allows students to explore many different properties of pendulums, from the weight to the length and to how they can affect different aspects of how a pendulum swings. The pendulum snake highlights an important property of pendulums that their swing rate depends on the length of their string. It makes pretty patterns and makes an interesting way of getting across this concept. The Procrystochrone is an interesting exhibit that helps students see how math can explain physical realities. <laughs> the hyperbolic funnel introduces students to the idea that planets orbit the sun due to warp and space-time rather than to the gravitational pull of the sun, which is typically viewed as the Newtonian point of view. The exhibit hall is full of many other exhibits that show things like standing waves, 
how we localize gravitational wave signals, and several others to get students excited and interested in the science. This beautiful light display gives a sense of spiraling gravitational waves. This gravity floor shows stars and planets zooming around. As students interact with it, they will begin to orbit the warps in space-time that occur by walking across it. The patio provides a space for students to enjoy lunch, enjoy the shrub step, as well as a place for us to host events like star parties. The pollinator garden is one of many design aspects that were included in the Lexi design to ensure that the building would receive LEED Silver certification. Other items include low VOC paints, recycling of materials, and a healthy environment for the staff that will be working inside the building. Another important LEED aspect is the electrical charging stations. We have nine electrical charging stations for various vehicles. LIGO is funded by the National Science Foundation and operated by the California Institute of Technology and the Massachusetts Institute of Technology.